Well, hello, everyone. Welcome to the call. My name is Dr. Kirk Fisnick, and I am glad you are here. What a great evening we're having here in Fargo, North Dakota. The weather's starting to warm up, and we're uh, we're seeing some warmer weather, and the snow is starting to melt. Actually, I'd say about half of it has melted. Um, so, yeah, I like that. I like that. But along with melting snow, we get floods. So I'm watching the river. The river's just across the street. And uh, and uh, they're saying that it's going to be some of our record flooding again. I like that. No, not really. Not really. But <clears throat> it'll turn into summer. It'll turn into summer. So we're uh, tomorrow, I think, we're just barely going to get over freezing. Enough about the weather. Tonight, we want to talk about collagen. Katie, are you going to go on video or just uh, talk tonight, today? I'm eating up. I was just getting my water. No, no, I've got some great slides for us to share. And uh, there's some from Sizzle's material, actually. Let me just bring on my camera. Hello. Welcome, everyone. Thanks for joining us today. And, Thanks for uh, being with us. Yeah, so I'll, yeah, thanks for being with us too, Dr. Curtin. If you've just joined us, welcome. And if you're watching the recording, thanks for taking the time out of your day to watch the recording. So um, I'll bring up the slides, shall I? And uh, there's nothing um, new that you wouldn't have seen. And I also want to thank uh, Ian too, if you're on the call with using some of the slides that he'd done previously. And, thanks, Ian. Uh, so I want to thank him. But yeah, thank you very much. It's uh, great content. And also the other information was shared by Sizzle Corporate on their Facebook page. So, all right, all right well, we're getting to it. A quick disclaimer. So none of the information we're sharing today is designed to treat, prevent, cure, or diagnose any disease or illness. Uh, the information has not been evaluated by the FDA. And if you are unwell, you should consult your healthcare provider. So we just wanted to put that in there. But uh, have you seen these slides, Dr. Kurt? So I, I have not. I have not seen them. Okay, great. So I'll go through them and let you um, talk to them, perhaps talk through them. Yeah, right, I was just so looking over the information on the Sizzle website. So as I'm looking at this first slide, that looks a lot like the uh, information found on Sizzle's website. Yeah. So this is, uh, so we're going to talk about two products today, two collagen products. Uh, it's a really interesting topic, the topic of collagen. It's really started to become a lot more popular in the last, you know, couple of years. And there's a very good reason for that because it has so many health benefits. And we're going to talk about those today. Uh, Sizzle has two great collagen products. So Sizzle has the Collagen B3, which we're going to go through now. And we've also got another collagen product called Renovator. Renovator. And uh, yeah, and so Kurt will jump in and talk um, about both of those. And we've got some slides we're going to go through um, with some great content. So Sizzle put together these slides on the Collagen B3 product just to educate people about the benefits of the product and what is the point of difference between Sizzle's collagen product and Juice's collagen products, um, but, you know, they're not all the same. And let's um, really try and understand what is the difference and what makes uh, Sizzle's product different to other products on the market. So the collagen B3 product contains 11 vitamins and minerals, as well as MCT oil, sugar, hyaluronic acid, uh, which are all essential in staying healthy and looking younger. It's really great for skin. So um, we've got some uh, comparisons, which we'll show in the next slides, but it says competitor four was uh, the closest competitor only having seven vitamins and minerals and no MCT oil or saga. And competitor do, two didn't even have enough vitamins or minerals to be able to claim on the supplemental facts panel. Um, if I drop it out. Yeah, you're really, you're really cutting in and out, Katie. It, uh, actually, hopefully I don't drop out. I've got, my playing up, hopefully I don't cut out. Um, and I'm gonna go buy a new one today, I've decided. <laughs> so um, yeah, can you hear me now? Yeah, let me let me just say here on this slide, I don't know where your slides are, if they have any, if you have any slides describing what collagen actually is. 
collagen, if you look at the word, what it means in, uh, in, in old, old language, it means glue. Collagen means glue. And what that mm. means is collagen is the glue that holds your minerals together in your bone. Collagen is the glue that holds together the amino acids in your, in your muscles. Collagen is the glue that holds your skin together, it gives it its plumpness. And so what happens is that as we age, we tend to lose some of that collagen. And then because of disease and because of diet and things like that, a lot of people lose collagen other ways too. And, uh, and and you start to get like you can have premature wrinkling, you can have joint problems, and we're going to talk about you know that I'm sure we're going to talk about on the slides that that uh, collagen B3 has three different types of collagen, where a lot of the products on the market will only have one type of collagen. So Katie, I wanted to throw that in there, and then MCT, of course, you know, um, I usually use MCT with my patients. Uh, I'll. Uh, I'll, I'll use it. I'll use it for patients when they start having memory problems, when they start having dementia, when they start having early signs of Alzheimer's. Uh, I can't make any medical claim, but um, you know, if I'm using it on my patients that have early signs of that, obviously there's studies that say that it helps. Um, and, and, you know, so that's, so that's important. And then of course, you know, Chaga is, is uh, probably, probably one of the best immunity um mushroom family um products on on the market as far as that goes and then it also helps with digestion one thing about about uh, collagen when we take a look at it you know type 3 collagen is really really important for the digestive system you know katie and i when we talk about good digestion when we talk about having good bowel movements and things like that um it always comes up that we we talk about these tight junctions how the how the um, cells, the single layer of cells in your gut um, are packed tightly together. And then, and then it's the mucous membrane that, um, that protects it from having incompletely pro broken down proteins getting through. And, uh, and that's what causes a lot of autoimmune type problems. But um, when it does break through, but if you're having any autoimmune problems and there's about 86 known autoimmune diseases that are named there's 86 named autoimmune diseases i think there's actually quite a few more than that but they just don't have a a, a formal name but um type 3 collagen which is one of the ingredients that we have in collagen b3 b3 meaning we've got type 1 2 and 3 um it's really really important for that <clears throat> and then of course we've got biotin and tryptophan tryptophan being the building block for serotonin which is the feel good hormone um neurotransmitter so not only does this make you look better and feel better but uh, it makes you mentally feel better too so katie i just wanted to add that because i don't know your slides and i don't know where that would fit in so i just threw it in now yeah excellent very um, good point sir so thank you dr kurt yeah, so this uh, slide's really talking about uh, berry dusting. So this is a common practice in the industry where, you know, supplement companies will just put a tiny token amount of a particular ingredient so that they can actually say it's in there. And then when you go look at the label to see how much is in there, it's barely anything at all. I remember a friend, actually a neighbour, um, who's on a limited budget, you know, went and bought a multivitamin that was on special. I think it was like 2 or $3 from the supermarket. And when I had a look at the quantities of minerals and vitamins um, in that product, it was it definitely was a fairy dusted product. I mean, you may as well probably have thrown it in the bin. There was hardly anything in there to have, have any benefit. So this is something Tom um, Senior would always say is to check the label and compare to other products. Um, so also the other thing is the price of collagen. So the average price range for collagen product, um, but price per gram of collagen um, it is um, anywhere from four to 11 times cheaper than most of our competitors in this particular product. When looking for the amount of collagen in a product and the price you pay for the actual collagen, that is the, the product, look at the supplement backs panel and uh, the amount of collagen in one serving. Take that amount of collagen, multiply it by the number of servings, then divide it by the price and that number. To compare uh, the collagen B3 price per gram, uh, multiply that by 376, which is the amount of collagen in the product. Also make sure you look at the amount of collagen that is in the collagen blend with competitor two, and we're gonna show you the slide, uh, 4.2 grams is the proprietary blend had 13 ingredients and only one contained collagen, bringing the amount of collagen even lower 
in the product than shown in the comparison graph. So um, that's all very nice words, and we'll show you uh, show you that comparison here in a second. But uh, it says that the collagen B3 has around 16 servings, which is the industry average, but it contains 35 grams of product um, in each serving. This means with each serving, you're getting more collagen, vitamins, and minerals. Um, you're also with competitor three, it has the closest amount per serving to the collagen B3, but only has 15 servings at eight grams per serving. So in the whole product, there are only 120 grams of the product for $43 um, to match the amount of product you would get with the collagen B3, you'd have to spend $200. So you've got to, you know, you don't want to compare apples with oranges, you've got to compare apples with apples. And so, you know, Sizzle have done this research here, you would have seen this um, particular slide here, perhaps Dr. Kurt. Uh, let me just move this here. Uh, so you can see in the first one, you've got the sizzle collagen. So we've got uh, types one, two, and three. And we've got the MCT oil, the hyaluronic acid, and we've got vitamins and minerals. We've got chagra in there, number of servings, amount of collagen in the product, amount of collagen in one serving, and the cost. Um, and so then there's competitor, top competitor one, top competitor two, top competitor three. And four. So we're not mentioning the actual brand names, but um, they're, they're popular competitors in the market. And so Sizzle's put together this comparison table. So you can see that really um, the Sizzle Collagen B3 comes out um, leaps and bounds ahead of the other products. Uh, so you really know that you're getting a high quality product. And that is really the point of difference with the Sizzle products is, you know, you're purchasing direct from the manufacturer. Sizzle um, the company, they own their own manufacturing facility, which is Supernaturals, right next door to the Sizzle offices, and they produce all their own products. And so, you know, they're the manufacturer. So we really have, you know, getting our information firsthand. And I think that's really important. We want to be able to get a product that you can A, trust is of good quality, and B, is not contaminated and doing any ill harm either, um, which is really important. So did you just want to add anything to this one here, Kurt? Yeah, I mean, when you look at that, I mean, there really is no comparison. Take a look at that, what you're getting. You know, you're getting 23 uh, uh, grams in a serving, and that's two scoops. And, boy, I tell you what, it's a good taste in product. I have it every morning. I take my two scoops um, right away, and I think it tastes really good. It's got a really good vanilla taste. Usually what I'll do is I'll mix it in my coffee because I it makes it taste like a latte, and, yeah. and it, it's really good. But the other thing that I want to point out is when you look at the types of collagen, types one, two, and three, those are the most abundant types of collagen that, that are in the body. Um, you look at competitor number one, competitor number two, you know, they have type one, type two uh, collagen. Number two just has type two, which uh, that's just for joints and, and for bone. It doesn't help with the skin or anything else. But then you look at the uh, competitor number three and number four, and what they'll try and tell you is they say, oh, yeah, but our product has um, all of these, uh, uh, you know, five types of collagen. Well, folks, I'm going to be real honest with you. Um, when you start trying to put in five types of collagen, read the studies on it, read the research on it. What they end up doing is they put so very little of, of each collagen in it that it really doesn't do you any good and to have those that that type five and that type 10 collagen in there it really doesn't it really doesn't help it and then look at the number of grams that they're giving you 3.1 and five grams yeah so yeah. i just had to throw that in because i've done some reading i did a talk on this on my doctor's clinic call when the product first came out and that's what oh, we fantastic. talked about fantastic yeah so as you mentioned there you said type 2 collagen is meant for the joints and bones is that what you said yes yeah, yeah, okay, great. So that brings us to the next product. So that's a sort of a wrap for the collagen B3. So if you haven't tried it, um, pop maybe when you do your next order, um, add that to your shopping cart and uh, give, it a, give it a try. It's a really great product and uh, you highly recommend it. So we've got some really good testimonials with the collagen. I mean, you yourself got good testimonials with the collagen B3, haven't you, Kurt? You noticed oh. a big improvement in your skin. Yeah, and I, I just like the product. It um... You know, there's so many things with collagen. You're, you're, you know, I, I'm 61 years old now. I turned 61 a week ago, and uh, at 61, I'll tell you, I mean, I feel, I feel better now than I did 20 years ago. I have, I have more flexibility. I have more ranges of motion. 
Um, I have a lot less uh, chronic pain, you know, and I attribute it to all the great products that we have at Sizzle. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Fantastic. So this is the Renovator product. Um, so Renovator is a specially formulated uh, supplement is specifically for musculoskeletal joint and cartilage function. So this one um, does support the skin, um, but it's really targeting, you know, for joints. And, uh, you know, as we suffer from a lot of overuse of our joints and the joints start to get inflamed. So, you know, consider it, you know, can you still hear me? Can you hear me? I hear you loud and clear. Okay, great. Sorry, it's just saying my computer was cutting out. Let me just yeah. Let me check here. Yeah. So this uh, here, we've got the ingredients here. So we've got um, type one and uh, sorry, type two collagen in this particular product. Um, but we've got the denatured and the undenatured. So you know, how does that? Uh, you know, can you? Talk well, let me let me talk say talk a little that, bit about. We were just uh, talking about the different type. Yeah, when you talk about type two collagen, again, it's it's specifically for bones and joints and things like that. So renovator, it's it's a joint product it's to help you get rid of pain in your joints it's to help you rebuild arthritis and things like that you know again we can't make any medical claim but um denatured protein or collagen what they do is they 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 take it and they mix it with different things and then they cook it and then they they liquefy the collagen so that it's easier to to um it's re it's easier to put in a product and um and there's some there's some properties of it that are good, but it's easier to put in a product. And when you look at most products that are on the market that use type two collagen, it's all denatured, all denatured. But you need some undenatured collagen as well. And what that is is that's collagen that's not in its it's it's not modified. It's it's allowed to be um, used just as as god put it together so it'll it'll go into the it'll go into the body and it'll it'll do some things that the denatured pro collagen cannot yeah fantastic and so in this product we've got a number of other ingredients and they're listed here but we're just going to go through them um, in the next slide so we'll cover them in a second but um yeah so here's some benefits of the collagen so um, muscle mass study. So this is not done on our product. We're talking about independent studies done on, on collagen but you're, ingredient and a two nine. Sorry, what happened? I cut out. Yeah, you're cutting out a lot. Yeah, I was just gonna say that you know when you look at the study, um, and this isn't done like Katie was saying. This isn't done on our product. This is done on just type two collagen. And what they found was is that they were able to uh, uh, retain muscle mass and increase the muscle mass and strength when people took uh, this type two type of collagen, which is found in our, our B3 product as well as in our, our, our renovator product. And then also they found in a, in a study that it helped with skin appearance by, um, like I was talking about earlier, it helps to plump up the skin. Think of like a, if you're crossing a bridge, you look at all the girders and all the, the cables and the wires that are holding that bridge together. That's what collagen does with your skin is that it holds your skin together. So it's got the, the appearance of a nice smooth feature where if you, your collagen, if, you, if it breaks down or if you're not getting enough collagen in your diet, your skin's going to start falling in on itself. And that's what happens when you start to have wrinkles. The collagen breaks down and, and the skin folds in on itself and it tries to protect itself by folding in. Um, and so when you start getting the collagen back, it rebuilds that structure. Yeah, fantastic. All right, since I'm cutting out, Kurt, I'll click through the slides and you can um, talk about the ingredients here. You bet. So with, uh, with uh, and I'm probably not gonna say this right, but lithothamidinium uh, calcium is a type of an algae. It's a coral type of an algae. It, it grows uh, in water and it's rich in calcium and magnesium. Magnesium, of course, it's, it's, a, it's a mineral in your body that's needed for, uh, you know, uh, so many different processes. I think, I think over 2,800 different uh, processes, uh, uh, biological processes that go in your body, but helps with detoxification, eliminating water, getting rid of water retention. Think about that with joints. When you have arthritis, what happens? You get inflammation, water retention. That's what inflammation is, water retention. You get rid of that. It reduces pain and, and it gets rid of effects of physical stress on the joint. Very good stuff. And then 
MSM, uh, methylsiphonyl methane. You know, I heard about this uh, methane way back, way back, probably about 1991, when is when I first started really discovering MSM. We didn't learn anything about it in chiropractic college. I graduated from chiropractic college back in 1987. So five years, four or five years later, when I was actually practicing as a chiropractor, I heard about MSM. And uh, MSM or organic sulfur was uh, found in in all all of our, a lot of our our foods, our fruits and vegetables, and things like that. But what happens is is that because of processing processing the food, the MSM, the the methyl methane, the organic sulfur is pushed out of the food, and uh, a lot of it is taken out and used as cattle feed. They give it to livestock. And they don't worry about humans because they, they they didn't really realize that we needed all these vitamins. They thought they could fortify it with synthetic and man-made vitamins instead, which turned out they can't. But um, MSM then, so how how they actually make it is when they when they uh, process wood, when they process trees, you know, they cut down trees and they grind it up and they make wood pulp, and then they use the pulp to make paper. Right. So they make paper so we can write on and things like that. Um, and then they take the organic sulfur and that's where we're getting the MSM is it comes and it comes from that from the did you know that, Katie, that that's that's where they get MSM is from uh, wood pulp. No, it's amazing. Yeah. And uh, but MSM is is one of the necessary ingredients. Uh, organic sulfur, I should say, is one of the organ is one of the ingredients that your body needs for healing. And, and so think about it. If you injure yourself and you don't have enough organic sulfur in your body, your body's going to get to a certain point in the healing process and it's going to stop. It's not going to skip that process. It's just going to stop. It's going to stop healing. Well, what is arth arthritis? Most arthritis is where the joint got damaged and all of a sudden now you got, the, you got this worn out joint. Well, what if we could take and we could we could finish that healing process? Well, for a lot of us, it's too late. Maybe uh, maybe you know you injured yourself twenty years ago and you didn't have enough organic sulfur in your diet back then. All of a sudden, now you got that arthritis. Is it going to get rid of it? Eh, probably not. But what it'll do is it'll get rid of the inflammation and it'll help rebuild. It'll help to rebuild the joint as much as it possibly can. And that's really, really important. So, isn't there uh, the sulfur in the fucoidin as well? Um, there, there is some sulfur in fucoidin as well. Yeah, but it's yeah. uh, but this is uh, yeah, this is this, is, and that's why that's why fucoidin is so good at getting rid of inflammation, right? I mean, because think about it, 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 you know, Tom Senior used to always say, you start, you take it, and within minutes of taking it, it starts to get rid of inflammation. Yeah, amazing. This is the next ingredient. Yeah, Boswellia, great anti-inflammatory. Um, I'm trying to think of some of the other names that it that it it, it comes under, but Boswellia is is really really good. Um, a lot of the topical products that you take and you you rub it on the skin. I think um, a Thermorol. I think Thermorol used to have Boswellia in it, and but it's just it's just a great natural anti-inflammatory. And Devil's Claw, uh, another another ingredient that they use on a lot of these topical type of ingredients. <clears throat> when you look at mineral ice, they call it mineral ice. You rub it on a joint, and it it kind of warms, and it's kind of got a cooling effect at the same time. Uh, that's what that's what Devil's Claw does, and 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 it uh, it's again, it's a great natural anti-inflammatory, really really good. Um, it helps with a lot of people that have worn out joints, which is what we call osteoarthritis. And then this one, um, you know, I didn't ever hear about the green lip muscle until mm. after uh, I started hearing about Renovator when mm. uh, when 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 I started using this. And and again, you know, it's uh, it's it, think about it. It's a shellfish. You know, there's a lot of natural things that come from the sea. Remember, our body is is seventy percent water, so it just makes sense that things that come from the sea are going to have a good effect on our body as far as relieving pain and getting rid of joint pain. And, you know, and, and, and again, rebuild the joint, get that fluid in there. Think about it. You know, we, when you hear people say, Oh, I've got arthritis, I've got bone on bone in my knee. I've got bone on bone in my back. Well, wouldn't it make sense that if you could take and you could give them something that would add that fluid, add that lubricant back into the joint, it's going to increase the joint mobility, just like it says here. 
Yeah, fantastic. You know, he talked a lot about green lip muscle that I heard in the last few years was um, the vet when she was coming to see my senior dog who's, um, you know, no longer with us, but she was really onto, you know, the green lipped muscle for, for dogs and for aging animals. You bet. You bet. Yeah, Chewy was always taking this product. Yeah, uh, you know, I dumped it in his food. He would, he could find capsules and he'd spit them out. You know, I'd wrap it in hamburger and cheese and, and he, <laughs> he, he somehow, he could take and he could unwrap the hamburger and the cheese and he could spit the pill out. And, uh, and, and so I had to just open it up and dump it in his food and, and yeah, he hated he it. Huh? Yeah, he hated it though. Yeah, he didn't like the food when I put it in there because you know you can taste it. It's got, it makes it kind of have a bitter taste to it. But you know, then I would take and I dump some barbecue sauce on, it and he's okay with it. Well, you know, the other thing that's quite not, you know, the food coitin's quite you know sweet for the animal too, and, and salty, so they like that too. No, he didn't like that either. Really? No, he's no. fussy. He fussy. was. He was. He was a. He was a fussy eater. So I had to. I had to put barbecue sauce and beef broth, <laughs> beef broth on everything so he would eat it. Yeah. Yeah. But, you know, then we talk about uh, curcuma, you know, curcumin, you know, and you, you turmeric. You think about that. I mean, boy, it, it's just, there's so much research on it that if you haven't heard of uh, turmeric and curcumin for, for joints and for the gut and for all those other things, yeah. I mean, you got to, yes. you got to, you got to do some reading. So for, for, you know, so the uh, curcuma longa is the extract from, um, sorry, just had a minute, look, is, is the extract from turmeric. Yeah, from right? turmeric, yep. Yeah, so, you know, people often using those words interchangeably, but actually you have to, people say, oh, well, you know, I'll just, I just add turmeric to my food, I eat a lot of turmeric, but no, because you have to eat a tremendous amount of turmeric to get the same amount that, you know, the actual extract, it's just not possible to consume that amount. Yep. Yeah, and, and there's there's other things in turmeric that you want, but you want the highest levels of curcumin um, for for you know joints and things like that, and and uh, so the curcuma longa is actually the most powerful of all the curcumins that they that they've discovered. Yeah, fantastic. Uh, okay, so you know it's got lots of benefits. Yeah, I, you know when I first started using uh, curcumin and turmeric. It was. It wasn't actually for joints, Katie. I mean, the first when I first started using uh, way back in the early '90s for my patients, it was actually for uh, IBS, for irritable bowel and Crohn's disease. That's where I started using turmeric and and curcumin. Um, it wasn't for arthritis. It was. It was for uh, Crohn's disease and and IBS. And I had great great results because it got rid of that inflammation. And again, you know, like like I was talking about, it closed those tight junctions between the gut, between the cells in the gut, and it helped get rid of that leaky gut syndrome. Yeah, fantastic. Uh, so it has other properties: antifungal, antibacterial, as well. So we'll just continue on there. Fennel, great. Yeah, and fennel Greek, you know, um, you know, I guess when I first started using it, it was mainly for the blood sugar, like that, like it says there, helps lower the cholesterol, helps control blood sugar levels, um, and that's where I mainly used it. Uh, but what I found was is that when you look at fennel Greek, it's got some other really good properties, and it it, it decreases pain. It helps. It's a natural pain uh, pain reduction. Wow. Okay, so the re the recommended dose for the renovator is four capsules daily. Um, so yeah, you take the two in the morning, two at night, or would you just take the four at once, there, Doctor Kurt? Yeah, and you know, I'm just going to say this. You know, um, I actually take more than that. I take six a day. And mm -hmm. I remember when I was talking to Tom Senior, he had a really bad shoulder. I don't know if you were aware of that, but he had a really bad shoulder. And he told me he was taking eight a day. He'd take four in the morning, four at night, and it would keep his shoulder pain uh, under control. And so he was taking a double dose. So so don't be afraid of taking extra. It's not going to hurt you. Um, and it's actually going to help, you know, the the, when when you look at the when you look at the dosage on a on a uh, vitamin product, for the most part, you got to remember that that the dosage is written um, more on terms of a maintenance type of a level. 
It's just mm-hmm. like when we talk about the age pill, you know, the, the six a day is considered the maintenance level. But if you really want to get some, um, some bang out of your, out of your product, you know, you got to take a double dose or sometimes a triple dose. And that's the same thing goes for a renovator. Don't be afraid of, of um, you know, if you take the four a day and you're going, oh, it doesn't seem to be helping, bump it up to six a day. If that doesn't seem to help, give it a week. If it's not, if it's not working, bump it up to eight a day. If that's not working, bump it up to 12 a day. And then once you get it under control, what I always tell people is kind of think of it like in terms of, of you know, how long does it take for the body to really repair? Um, it really takes about a month for every year that you've had a problem. So if you've had arthritis for 18 years, it's going to take 18 months for you to get that to get that joint uh, uh, repaired. Uh, you know, and that's just kind of a just kind of a figure that I learned a long time ago. And and it, it varies for everybody. Somebody said, well, how long is it going to take? Well, you know, it varies for everybody. Some people, you know, two weeks, they're they're back to normal. And some people, it takes a lot longer than that. Yeah, wow. Okay, and uh, we've got some testimonials here. So can you hear me okay? Am I cutting in and out? You're coming in really clear. Yep. Okay, great. So we're nearly finished here. So this was a, a testimonial from Christy. She said she was experiencing pain at night in her hips and uh, lower back issues and turning from side to side, even laying on her back didn't relieve the pain. She was awake for a couple of nights and uh, she took the three renovator before bed and she found that, you know, her pain was um, gone and she slept through the night. So she feels uh, this is a great product for her. So that is a really awesome testimonial. Um, And uh, another product, another testimonial here that um, she opened a bottle of renovator uh, for her, her father, for Father's Day for his knee pain. And uh, he took it daily and he was really happy with um, it helping his pain and uh, he was able to sleep. So, yeah, so that is another great testimonial there. And then um, here we've got another testimonial again with knee pain uh, surgery. This person's had surgery, um, failed wrist surgery and uh, having lots of aches and pains. I'm not going to read the whole thing, but anyway, they were seeing specialists. And uh, he was suggesting to have an operation and fuse the bones, but uh, he had a splint instead and started taking the renovator. And uh, he now now no longer needs the splint. So, um, you know, as as you said, it can really support the body to do what it what it does naturally. And again, we're not making claims about the product, but, you know, it does support overall health, doesn't it? Yeah, you bet it does. Yeah. Okay, and that's that's it. Thanks for being with us, everyone. You know, every week we do these calls. We try and bring good information. We we usually talk about products and 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 you know, and sometimes we talk about the business too because you know, really, it's a network marketing uh, business, and and you know, and so we we really want to focus on uh, the products because that's what's kind of fuels the business. But at the same time, we want to talk about the business aspect of it too. So sometimes we talk about that. But you know, Katie is uh, Katie is an expert on on products, and she's gone to school um, since graduated from college and gotten some extra training on nutrition and and that. And I'm a chiropractor. I've been practicing for uh, over 30 years, and my background for the last uh, 30 20 years is really been just nutrition. And then I do, I do a lot of stem cell work, working with people uh, doing stem cell education. And, and I work with a couple of clinics on, on patient education as far as stem cells. And, you know, all of this stuff, it just leads to helping people find a healthier life. Because, you know, when we start looking at longevity, uh, you know, half the battle is just making sure that you get there in one piece, you know, I mean, if you if you get to be 90 years old and 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 you feel like you're 180 what what good does it do to be 90 years old right katie exactly there's not much point you know quality of life is extremely important and that's you know it's not just longevity it's the quality of our life quality of life health span health span versus lifespan exactly that's all a right. good one all right thanks everyone have a great weekend bye everyone bye.